So before we put it away, we're going to take our slide all the way off. And when we take it off, this is the very, very gentle part of the slide. We're going to rest it gently in our case. And you're going to see, if we flip our trombone over, and we'll take our mouthpiece out too just so that it doesn't fall out, you're going to see that there's kind of a, a little ring that happens towards the edge of your slide. This is actually the only part of the slide that's touching the slide here. This is the only part of your inner slide that touches the outer slide. So a lot of you guys have some slide cream. This is what we're going to do to make our slide nice and fast, to lubricate it up. If I take some slide cream, I'm not going to use like a giant wad like we do with toothpaste. In fact, I'm going to use even a little bit. so You can see how small that is on my finger. And I'm going to use this on both sides. Just a little bit on this side and a little bit on that side. I'm going to rub it above this line all the way around the slide, just like this. I'm not going to put a ton on. And that's really all I need. Now, there's a secret when it comes to putting the slide back on, because that can be kind of tricky. When I take the slide, I want to make sure that the little keyed part, which is the slide lock, goes on the same side as the slide lock. If I put it on the wrong side, your slide lock won't work anymore, which you can easily fix by taking it off and flipping it. But it's better to just put it on right the first time. I'm going to tilt my slide so that it rests just like this. And I don't know if you can see that. I'll bring it up nice and close so that both ends of the slide rest on the outer tube. I'm just going to gently twist it up, and I'm done, just like that. And I'll show you from this angle, too, because it might be easier to see. I take the end of my slide just like this. I tilt it up, whoop, and it goes right back on. It's way better to do that than to try to put one in and then try to figure out where the other one is. You're going to be there for hours and hours. Simply tilt, bring it up, voila, just like that. Now, when we put it away, we want to make sure that we twist the slide lock so it's nice and locked. It's not going anywhere. And first things first, we already took our mouthpiece off. We'll put that in our little compartment here. Put my slide cream in as well so we don't forget that. Now, the only part you have left to take apart is the bell and the slide. So we're going to take our little screw here. We're going to twist lefty-loosey, just like so. And to take it apart, I'm going to hold both my slide and my bell and gently pull and twist. I'll show you that one more time. I'm lifting my bell up and the slide down, just like so. I'm going to put the slide in first because that's the most delicate part. I'm going to rest it just like it was. I'm going to put my bell just like it was. And now, my case has two little latches. I'm going to turn this one 90 degrees. I'm going to turn this one 90 degrees so my slide can't fall out and hit my bell. Now everything's put away. All I'm going to do is close my case up nice and gently. I do one latch, two latches, three latches. Voila, we've put our instrument away. Now you're free to go. Thank you for watching this movie. I hope you learned how to put your instrument together, how to make a sound, and I hope you're really excited about playing the trombone. So again, my name is Mr. Sherwin. I teach in Plainville, and I'm looking forward to having you in my class or seeing you very, very soon. Bye.